So right now we got the sweat class going on. That's the conditioning class for the gym. Um, I think I'm like one of, probably one of the only people who have a class like that. Not only that, I kind of invented it. It's kind of uh, a little more dialed down version of CrossFit. We don't use the barbells. You don't need to do any of the aggressive stuff. Just a lot more dumbbells, a lot more kettlebells, a lot more user friendly for people who come in for their first time. So when you walk in there, you're going to see how crazy it is. So every Saturday is a team workout, so you get a lot of people show up and they just want to hang out with each other and they're all texting each other the night before and making strategies and stuff. It's, it's actually pretty cool. If you cruise around enough, it's like the Seinfeld of CrossFit. If you don't watch Seinfeld, fucking unsubscribe from this YouTube channel. <laughs> All right guys, as you can see, this place is crazy. It goes down every Saturday. It's my favorite day of the week. I think it's their favorite day of the week too. Um, we're always crowded Monday through Friday, but Saturday is definitely by far the biggest day. I think because it's team workout, everybody gets together. It creates a big community vibe. It's something that a lot of CrossFit gyms are missing. Um, and I think it's the reason why we do so much better than so many other people in the world is because we have that community vibe and that Saturday class is big time. As you can see, there's no lack of fun in there. <laughs> and as you can see from the workout, the workouts are really hard. I specialize in that. And we're known all over the world for a reason. Um, I love this place more than anything. I, I call it home. There's nowhere else I'd rather be at for at least a few hours out of the day. If it wasn't for this, I wouldn't really have much going on in my day that I'd be excited about. All right, so let's go say hi to some people. Show them how to do some movements. Show them how to get a little sexier. Show them how to be a little bit better in the world. Let's take it on down. Right. Right after Boom. Um, How was it? Ain't <laughs> hey, nobody had this much fun in the gym since Santa Claus. <laughs> the whole world, huh? It is. No. <laughs> I don't know why do you even need it? Do you even you need a double, like size-wise, it's money? Or do you need a double? No, it's this big. Good God. I don't think I'm gonna be able to work out after. <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to jerk off after. <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to even think about. Well, I could probably think about a few naked ladies out there, but <laughs> most we'll likely, most likely I'm down for the count after. This is gonna be like round seven, Rocky Balboa, just fucking done. So, 
Going out to eat is not something I do typically. Uh, definitely, you have to be social, so you have to go out with people every once in a while. But what I try to do is try to find these like really, really good spots that people don't know about that are one, really healthy, and two, just really, really good food. So this place is called ARC, A-R-C. It's probably my favorite burger place in the whole world. Like literally, anywhere I've ever been, this is definitely my favorite burger place. Fong, don't you think? Yeah, it's great. It's a really, really good burger it's spot. Delicious. It's a pig, pig, cow, and what is it? Pig, cow, and... Pig, cow, duck, but it's duck. duck. They cook duck, it in duck. duck fat. Oh, okay, okay. And it's a one pound patty, it's huge. Good shot. And then they put it on a cast iron pan, which I'm a big fan of, instead of uh, Teflon. And then they put it in a brick oven and, and cook it. And they use all real grills, no flat iron grills with like vegetable oil and all that stuff. So it's just like highest quality food you're gonna get at a restaurant. And then, yeah, that's what I, that's what I try to shoot for. I try to never get a flat grill. Okay. You never wanna go anywhere where they have a thing of oil that's like in a clear bottle and it just looks like this ghetto thing that they put on the, on the grill because that's always gonna be vegetable oil or canola oil or something that's unfavorable of all the oils. And then usually I try to stay carbohydrate free, but I did just work out, so I'll probably eat the bun. Because for me, I try to earn my carbohydrates. So typically I don't eat any carbohydrates throughout the day until either a little bit before the workout and always after the workout. But sometimes I don't have any before and I only have it after. I mean, I think you take a lot more away from it. Different kind of flavors. <laughs> it's a different kind of experience for sure. So the burger is gonna be insane. That's gonna be the thing that you guys are gonna wanna see the most. It's gonna be like this big, no joke. And you're gonna smash it down. It's one pound, made out of short rib, bacon, and beef. It's cooked in duck fat on a cast iron pan in an oven. I should work here. Um, and then always have to get the bacon because the bacon looks like this. It's gonna be insane. Okay, let's go. Like you look at that. Yeah, that would be us. I don't know if this is. Uh, you should tell him help. Somebody. Did anyone get a medium? Yeah. <laughs> wow. Look at that. Wow. <laughs> this is going to be the best. <laughs> All right, fellas. You have to. Prime time. <laughs> I was just telling my cameraman here, I'm going to look over in about 10 minutes. He's just not going to have any pants on. <laughs> not for any specific reason. I just feel like it just, it would probably, it would go down better without pants on. <laughs> This needs it. God, this size. This is Roxanne. <laughs> this is mine. It is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, a professional does this. He knows how to do it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and the honey. All right, guys. Finally wrapped up a day in the life. You guys got to roll up with me on the one wheel. Got to hang out with the classes and see how insane it is. You guys can feel those vibes. I know you felt those vibes. Not only that, but you guys get to go to my favorite place to eat, Ark Burger. Huge thing, smash it down. Not all of us made it, but try to get it all in our mouth in one shot. Anyway, every Tuesday we're gonna have videos of this caliber or higher. Promise you it'll be higher. And you guys get to hang out with me and live the life. California IA, chalk style, with Ryan Fisher, your boy. Over and out.